back and we are moving into our second segment for today where we're featuring the one and only Rebecca Sturm. Good morning. Good morning. It's nice to have you. <laughs> and uh, we are, of course, showcasing your twig and pearl bag yes. lines. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. So twig and tw what what what's that twig and pearl bag line? You've got everything nice here, don't you? Rocking one too. Tell Thank us about you. this one. Okay, so the handbag collection I launched almost three years ago, mm -hmm. and um, it was kind of my way of building a brand that kind of encompasses everything I love about Belizean life, Sweet. about using natural materials, mm -hmm. sustainable practices, and my way to really express what I love making, right? Sweet. And so these handbags over here, mm -hmm. this is our basket collection. And this is our most recently released yes. mm -hmm. collection. These are my major favorites right now. And I mean, everybody is saying, that's not my own basket. No, that's <laughs> not, not a Jippy Jappa basket. No. no, so these baskets were actually inspired by the basket maker himself. Mm -hmm. It's a man that I've known my whole life. I think we have a video actually mm -hmm. that Oops. they're probably going to show right here. Yeah. But um, I've known this man my whole life. He mm -hmm. makes baskets. He goes to the bush, uh -huh. collects the tatai, mm -hmm. uh -huh. and weaves the baskets. And he was always just making home baskets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I'm always seeing these baskets and I'm thinking, these would make amazing handbags. Uh -huh. So we partnered up together mm -hmm. and he actually helped design some of the shapes and stuff of the handbag. What? Uh -huh. Yeah. And now it's actually not just him that I'm working with, it's his whole family that we're working with. Oh, so wow. they weave the most amazingly neat and unique baskets and we transform them into handbags. Look this has got to be a difficult process. Like, how do you get, because it's, it's, it's very firm. It's not as, yeah. I mean, leather is pretty inflexible in itself, but this yeah. is even. Yeah. It's, so when he collects the material, it's covered in thorns. Okay. Which is really, really difficult to get from the bush. Yeah. Crack the thorns off his hands are covered mm -hmm. in the prickles and then he has to actually strip down that vine and weave oh, it there you go. Mm -hmm. On into the yeah. exactly yeah weave it into these baskets so it's a really like interesting and tedious and very careful process and then for us what we add in is of course the leather strap yeah, yeah. the full lining which is hand printed cotton yes it's kind of our signature and the buckles the tassels we kind of add the element of style and class to the basket so what's been the response so far People love them almost as much as I do. Those are nice, though. This one is actually new. It's so uniquely Belize, the way it looks. Exactly, exactly. So we see a lot of the basket bags around, but they're all the woven palm leaves. Yeah. And I see nylon ones, too. Yeah, it's a fake. We wanted to go something really genuine, authentic, and truly Belizean. And that's what these are, so. And they're sturdy, because they're basket bags. There you go. Gosh, look at this. 100% Belizean. Yes, yeah. sir. Look at the beauty of it. Mm? You even got design for it too. <laughs> yes. Banana leaves. I know <laughs> this. <laughs> I love it. And you know, the, the sturdiness of it, it, uh, it, it, it signifies a lot to us, especially with, uh, you know, when it comes to the, uh, the, the, the woven things that you've got yeah. on here. I love this. Yeah. this it's is a great, great bag. Yeah. Could try sling us away up, man. I don't know if that really suit you, but all right. Well, right kind of front, so leave it. And then it depends on the way you, you stand up. One man back. Yeah, yeah, I'm worse. Oh, there you go. That's a good yeah. job. Yeah. I'm learning a lot from you. But, <laughs> but she does nice. have man bags, actually. Yes, we have our really big adventure bag, which I didn't bring today because it takes up so much space. And yeah. that's one of our signature pieces, right. along with our Ashley tote. This is our signature signature piece, mm. one of which I actually see across the room, yeah. which is yours. <laughs> But it's our I most love it. sold. It's, it's our bestseller. Yeah, yeah. We love it. It's oh. the one we've perfected the most. We've done numerous versions and perfected to becoming this one. And then one of our other signature pieces is this little one down here, mm -hmm. our Mona mini bag. This one? And this one we're actually going to be giving away today. Sweet! So the way that people can enter to that. win this one Throughout September, we want to be celebrating all things Belizean life. Yes. Okay. So celebrating what we love, our favorite things, our favorite foods, mm -hmm. our favorite moments of Belizean life. Yeah. yeah. So the way you can win it, uh -huh. you can either direct message us on Facebook mm -hmm. or Instagram telling us what you love about Belizean life, 
or you can actually post and hashtag celebrating Belizean life. Mm -hmm. Okay. Either of those will get you an entry. And we're giving away on Monday. Sweet. So you have all weekend. You can enter as many times as you like. The more times you enter, the more chances you have at winning. We're doing a random drawing. So you can win one of our Monas. These are one of our favorites. It's local Belizean hardwood and locally sourced leather. Interior, hand printed cotton. It's our signature. See, and you have multiple colors too. Yes. Yes. That's what no, we have. We have the natural does. tan, we have the chocolatey Ooh, fawn brown, does. and we also I love do this black. One. I love I this. This bring. is beautiful. Yeah. This is beautiful. They are. You know what? But what strikes me the most is actually. You talk about them like your babies. Like, look at them. <laughs> They're all grown the, up. You know, the, the thought of it is, is, is I've never seen a person, uh, forgive me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a purse that you know with the woven uh, with the woven base, so you could hold it and uh, you know yeah, you could go the around sturdy with wooden it. handle. Yes, and uh, then again, it shows how authentic, b authentically Belizean it is. Yes. That's one of the things I love about it. Twig yes. and pearl. I grew up working with a lot of wood. My dad does carpentry, and my brother does carpentry okay. as well. Oh, they do that on the side. So I grew up around a lot oh. of woodworking tools, and it was only natural mm -hmm. that I would, of course, have hardwood in the handbags. You know, nice. th this just takes me back to your original story with Twig and Pearl, which yes. is, uh, you spoke of wanting, moving away from uh, making clothing. Yes. And focusing on something where you knew you were still contributing uh, by using materials that would have been considered scrap or have yeah. gone to waste. And really just uh, not only creating something beautiful, but being a part of sustainable development. And yes. now incorporating all these other items it seems like you're staying true to that theme mm. absolutely you absolutely. probably see materials everywhere like why are they why are they getting rid of that I can't yeah. it. <laughs> oh my god even down to our leather like we have kind of a no waste policy uh -huh. I work with two girls yeah. it's the three of us working in the studio making things and we go to unnecessary lengths mm -hmm to do a no waste cutting policy where we line everything out to where there's no waste and even the extra pieces of leather mm -hmm. we're now working on some pieces where we're cutting kind of art deco shapes oh and like this that's what i thought that's like yes. perfect yeah. for what's literally left over. using all of our or tassels nice. yes. we go to crazy lengths to make sure that everything is used fully utilized and then nothing is going to waste now but that also takes up the cost of what it is to make it the time the resources a lot of people can just pick shortcuts and say okay I'm yeah. you know nobody's really gonna know if it's scrap wood or I bought them pre-made like this yeah. yeah but we care and we want that things would last long yeah we want that things would not go to waste mm -hmm. yeah and we want to see beautiful things coming from something that maybe wasn't so beautiful before mm -hmm. nice. so even the hardwoods that we've chosen are like cedar and Purple Heart and hardwoods that like it's literally scrap pieces off of projects yeah. that we've taken and made into something. All oh, right, this is Tell so, so you can walk away. It's the Mona, right? Yes, mm -hmm. the Mona mini bag. Mona mini bag, and all you have to do is post a photo or send the photo to Twig and Pearl with a quick description letting us know what you love about mm -hmm. Belizean life. Yes, make sure you hashtag celebrating Belizean life, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and you can either post, direct message us. Either of them will be an entry. You can. As it, many times as you want. And it's a and random it's a photo pic. we're asking a random for, right? Pic. It's not even the photo. We want the actual description. Oh. So direct message us. Don't need to even have a photo. Yeah. We want your description. We want you to tell us what you love about Belize in Life. Because there's a lot of things I love yeah. about Belize in Life. Of course. But I want to know what you guys love about Belize in Life. What would you post? Yeah. Oh, that's a good one. What's I would I would need to I would need to Belizean my life. top Belizean I would need to sit and think about it for real. I <laughs> can't just come just up with it. Seriously? I don't got tree. I need to I tell it. you what, I tell you what, there's so many there's so much things about this country that mm -hmm. if I should just say one right now, I might think oh, that wasn't the one. But we won't judge it. Because we there's so you. many things. Okay, so I'll go. Mm -hmm. So if I think of Belizean life, I think of uh, calm sunrise just here in the city, living next to the coast. It's oh, just peaceful and beautiful and quiet and we just have direct access to it yes. every is. single day yes. yes and people pay so yeah. much for this mm -hmm. my favorite thing is that we have coconut trees in our yard mm -hmm. and my partner goes out and literally chops coconuts fresh coconut water i don't have to buy it yeah i don't have to get it in a can it's right there on my tree and it's free let me let me let me throw one out. Okay. My favorite Belizean life is being able to go and sit upon a mango tree and just eat all the mangoes you want. Fresh, fresh off the tree. Off the tree. Juicy and not care how you look. 
Yeah. Her body, her mango juice. <laughs> so I just don't want to leave that spot. And you the skin and the seed down, because you know what? You'll get more it, mango it juice. Exactly. Again. It will grow again. I think, you know, and I think that's one of the things that we really need to celebrate about, yeah. about our country. Yeah. You know what? Some of mangoes. Too. That's a great one, too. See, now too many are coming to my Wanna mind. Want to stir me up? Yeah. But, but one of the things I wanted to get to was the canvas. And then again, yeah. you've got okay. some art on it. Can you tell us about so this? So these banana pieces are kind of along the lines of celebrating everything we love about Louisian life. What, a, what did you say banana pieces? Yes. Oh, because it's bananas We're on little, them. Yeah, I'm a little obsessed <laughs> yes. with bananas right now. So our new collection that's launching in about two weeks is banana themed. Ooh, you're going banana. We are going bananas. About bananas. I hate when we travel abroad and when we eat bananas and they taste chalky, they're not so great. And I always think, first of all, God. who pays that price for Seriously. it when you travel? I'm like, no, I'm Why waiting until I, I get back yes. to Belize. <laughs> Do you know what it costs? Fresh Belize and banana, I don't want it. Yeah. So that's one of the things I love about life here is bananas. Mm -hmm. We got fresh bananas, left, right, and center. 24 on 10 for dollars, yes. 8 for dollars, 6 for dollars. So much. Yes. So we kind of wanted to celebrate that a little bit. Everyone's going crazy about pineapples. We're going bananas. <laughs> so the entire collection is banana themed. Uh -huh. We have really cute backpacks with banana prints. And we also partnered with a digital artist from down south, this guy named Kieran. And he actually designed the print for on the canvas tote and on one of our other backpacks. This is so cute. Yes. And so we're really, really excited about this collection. Yeah. Here's where I see this most popular. We know that we are preparing to move away from yes, single-use uh, plastics, Plastic. which means everybody's going to have a bag mm -hmm. exactly. in their car. And you know what? Why not have this really to carry your one. groceries in? Exactly. <laughs> so we've been trying to encourage our customers. You just have to have a plastic line. Right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. I did not think of that. That's a good one. I'm going to write that down. <laughs> but yeah, on the screen just now, you would have seen some of the images of the collection. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this piece specifically, yes, we have been trying to encourage our customers to buy numerous time use, heavy duty canvas bags. Yep. I have one that I use everywhere I go. We pack all of our groceries, picnic stuff, everything into these heavy duty canvas bags. Mm -hmm. With this though, is like a stylish canvas yes. bag. So you can pop your beach stuff into it mm -hmm. or pop your groceries into it. it. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah. We're doing them with leather handles and then also with canvas handles for vegans we're trying to be a little more vegan friendly with some of our pieces Sweet. it stands out to me the though artwork, the, yeah though. the artwork really this it's is beautiful really isn't then, he's such an amazing artist this is this mm -hmm. guy kieran williams then you've and got he a designed tassel. it's a little tassels aren't they cute we added oh. those on as a little extra texture look right at that believe Right. And it's all shades of brown, you know, the hands. Yeah. That's and the that's thing. Always about culture, yeah. I love it, man, for real. That's the thing. And everyone's so mixed. That is another thing to celebrate about yeah. Louisiana life. We don't have racial issues. We are all so mixed. There's so many colors, such an array of people. Yeah. That is a huge. Yeah, something huge. to live by. We're Belizean yeah, first. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. This one actually comes with an additional strap to become a backpack. So, oh, that's why this one is yes. Yeah. So it loops through this little loop at the back. Uh huh. Has a second strap and it becomes a little backpack strap. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Yes. We actually took this Did one. Did you print the canvas or no? I actually got the canvas okay. as is. Okay. So it took me a while to find a banana print canvas, but <laughs> when I did, I snagged it as quick as I could. Alright, there did you get go. That one up. Yeah. So we're talking about. So you have canvas, you have leather, you have basket. And you have the incorporation of both wood and leather here. And now we're moving into the front of the line. Right? Yes. Is, so everybody, or who doesn't know yet, these are back in style. Seriously. And uh, there you go. Yeah, you rock your as a true. <laughs> so we were joking that you're going to call them belt bags. Yes. Okay. This is the proper <laughs> stylish term, so I don't feel like my grandma calling it a fanny pack. I can't bear to call it that. It's a belt bag. It's a so belt bag. <laughs> So I was saying a while back to the girls here, I said, I can't believe fanny packs are back in style. <laughs> and that's just what happens. But when you update it to this, yes. yeah. rather than like the plastic and the, the yeah, yeah clasp to the back, things, yeah. oh, this makes it so much more stylish. Yes. Look at Look that. that. It's like yeah. a fab version. So we kind of wanted to do a spin off of one of our uh -huh. signature pieces, the mm -hmm. Mona. It's the exact same cut as the Mona mini bag. Uh -huh. Except we added in the little sick. ring. <gasps> Woo! Down yeah. it goes. Mm -hmm. That you know would be. They're me. super sturdy, so it's okay if you try. Yeah, I know. You didn't yeah, get nervous, so I knew it was fine. Exactly. <laughs> so there you go. Exactly what this it looks should good be. On you. Yeah, it does, right? Okay, like how tight are you supposed to wear it? Um, I usually wear mine kind of like 
right on your around. The, the yeah, hip, it's yeah. like it sits up at the top I'm of your hip and kind of falls down. It's cooled on belt bar. It's cooled. And then you can swing it around. And sometimes I kind of do like a little wrap. Yeah, it's a wrap. For a little stylish vibe. And off. there you go. There you go. Look at that. Oh, we're matching. Matchy, we matchy. Like <laughs> <laughs> John, do you want to try? So unfair. <laughs> no, no. dudes. Oh, you, man. You can wear this. Yes. And then, so this is the other one that pairs with this. These ones are launching next week. Yeah. Yeah. This is our bangle bag. Mm -hmm. So you know how when we're young, all the way we get Annalise Silva. Yeah, bangles. Silver yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what Annalise Silva bangles with yes. those balls? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> this was inspired by that. It's the bangle bag. Yeah. And it kind of doubles as a bracelet. Yeah. I love that it doubles as a bracelet. Yeah. I don't get any bracelets, but yeah. it's also my handbag. And then recently, I accidentally discovered it can also work as a belt bag. I put my regular belt looped through it, mm -hmm. and it drops right there as a cute little it. belt bag. Only you would discover so, that. I think, yeah. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, what I'm seeing from it as well, especially when you're holding it, it's actually about, well, my hand big. Your hands are big, yeah. Yeah, yeah but it's actually, it actually, um, it actually poses as safety as well yes. for your for your product. So yeah. if you got your phone, your they mother, They can't snatch whatnot, it if it's attached to your hand. If that's around your wrist, yes. there, there's no way they could snatch yes. it. Yes, and that metal ring is heavy and it's hard, and I always joke with the girls at work, if anybody tried to do nothing, you'll take it and you'll box it. Well, I thought of that with this. I didn't know how you felt about beating people with it. But no, there you, go. you need to have a gorgeous bag that's also sturdy. And Don't mess the ring with is a me. Great the ring is great. Yeah. Yeah. Don't mess with the ring. Well, you know, when they teach you self defense, they say use whatever tool you have. And a handbag is a great there tool. There you so go. You always have it on you. This is so awesome. And this is only a snippet of what you Just have available. Yeah. So everything else that we have, we carry a full line on twigandpearl.com. Mm -hmm. That's our retail site. And we generally update the collection every few months. Yeah. New pieces like our banana bags, our basket bags. But the Ashley Toe Mona mini bag, our adventure bag, those are it's staple pieces. Yes, our yeah. longer Bella sling. Mm -hmm. Those are staple basics. Yeah. So we always have all year long. And we've actually added the basket bags to those. Those have become official baseline pieces that we'll have all year long. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And so we can only you could only get these uh, via the website or yes. they're in stores. So we or have them at a few resorts. We have them at Victoria House, mm -hmm. Turtle Inn. We have them at Kaj Expressions in San Ignacio and Placencia. But we actually love when our customers shop online with us because we're trying to push heavily for local online shopping. But of course, but of course. Yes. So if, uh, like for instance, my mom lives abroad and yes. she would like one of these and she would want it over there. We ship internationally. Really? We ship locally on Tropic Air and BFMS and we ship internationally. So. so you check out the collection on the website. Yes. You see which one you want. Add Can it I? to your cart. Uh -huh. Fill in your details. You can either choose to pay with cash uh -huh. or you could choose to pay with your credit card. We send it to you. Easy. All done. Easy peasy. <laughs> I love it. And that's that. <laughs> you are a magician. <laughs> so here's one of the things I think we didn't mention. So mm. like your leather bags, they do come in different colors. And I have yes. to ask you, what do you find people most attracted to? Yeah. Are they going for like natural tan, the black, cho the chocolate brown? Okay, so this is super funny, but the lightest, easiest to get dirty bag is our best seller. The lightest? Which easiest. is hilarious. The lightest, natural, undyed tan we sell the most of. And for me personally, I, I get lipstick on it. Mm -hmm. My little four-year-old nephew gets pen on it and crayon. Uh -huh. But they're our best sellers, I think, because they're the most natural. Yeah. 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 They're untreated, uncolored. They yeah. literally just have a wax finish yeah. That's it. protecting them. Yeah. And so those are our best-selling color. But right now, since we've added the chocolatey fawn brown, mm -hmm. those have become a second best-selling color. Oh, so. so it is the more natural colors that people are yeah. going for. Because the chocolate is like a dark, darker brown. Yeah. And then there's the black. Yes. Mm. Or you can get all colors. There you go. Just get one of each. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but these are extremely nice. And I, I'm so proud of the fact that they are 100% made right here at home yes. in Belize. We're yeah. so proud of that. We love that about the brand. Wow. Rebecca, we're so thankful that you came in and shared this all with us. We're so proud of the work that you do. These are uh, handmade Belizean products with Belizean materials yeah. and uh, I love that uh, really the core of what you do is about sustainability mm -hmm. and so you know there's no reason people shouldn't support primarily because they're gorgeous uh, and, <laughs> and second of all for everything else I just said but don't forget you can get your very own Mona mini handbag uh, if you participate in the online competition and you only have three days three, three days, days. Today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Sunday. Monday, yes. they select the winner. Instagram or Facebook, make sure to hashtag yeah. celebrating Belizean life. Mm -hmm. Send us a quick DM. 
letting us know what you love or post mm -hmm. letting us know what you love about mm -hmm. Belizean life either of those will get you an entry you can enter as many times as you want more entries more possibility, more possibility. to win yeah. and, we want you and to there are lots of reasons why we love Belizean life God there's so life. many reasons so you can't just have send one them all. <laughs> and one of the things uh, just before we leave one of the things I love about this competition or this uh, this pick out is the fact that uh, they're, they're not uh, you guys are not judging by what is being said no the more chances you you put in there the better it is for you to win yes. it's randomly we chosen. want to celebrate together and we want to collect positive amazing things yeah. about Belize because we love Belize and we want to remind our followers and ourselves what's so amazing why we're so blessed oh my god there you go. go oh my god find gosh. the pages twig and pearl Instagram Facebook uh, like and follow, send your favorite thing about the Belize life mm -hmm. uh, by Sunday and you may get your very own Twig and Pearl bag. I also was mentioning, and I think it's really cool, that people can order a monogram bag from you. Yes. So usually at Christmas time we offer free initialing on the handbags. Mm -hmm. It's great for gifting, to put their little initial or a tiny little note on the inside of the bag. A lot of gifters, yeah. husband's wife, says it's perfect for that. So for Christmas, we will be reopening free initialing again in November for Sweet. Christmas orders. So awesome. Beautiful. All right. We got to go ahead, though, and take a break. And uh, when we come back, another favorite Belizean product. <laughs> it's uh, ice cream the from the ice cream shop. shop. Yes. Oh, God. It's we'll fun be, Friday. We'll be back in a few. Stay tuned. <laughs>